This video has been brought to you by anahta.org. Experience a personalized study of Islam in depth and with relevance to your life. For more information, please visit anahta.org. If you're looking all confused, ask Baba Ali. And you don't know what to do, ask Baba Ali. If you want advice from a friendly funny guy, ask Baba Ali. The Art of Complaining It seems like whenever you need help, there's a shortage of people. Help? Help? Where is the help when you really need it? There's nobody here! But when it comes to complaining, we have plenty of volunteers. I don't like it! Aren't you just exaggerating just a little? Okay, okay, okay. I just don't like it. It's like anytime someone tries to do something good for this ummah, there's a line of people ready to give criticism. We don't like this one. We don't, we don't make it much better. What do you mean? What you're doing, brother, what you're doing, this thing, no good. Okay, well, well, do you have any advice? Do you want to hear a joke? Uh, not really, I'm actually looking for advice. Okay, I'll tell you a joke anyways. Take notes. Some people, they tell me, you should be a mom. I say, no, I will not be a mom. You know why I say I don't want to be a mom? Uh, I don't know why. Because I don't want to be a mom, I want to be a dad. <laughs> uh, was that a joke? Yes, it was a joke. You don't understand these things. Who is this guy? Who is this guy? You make the videos? This is what is this guy? I think you misunderstood my videos. The point is to make a point, not necessarily to make people laugh. Now, if, if people laugh and there's humor inside of it, that's just my personality coming out. But I still don't like it. I don't like it. Make better. Make better! Why do people like to complain? <laughs> because it's easy to complain. Sometimes it feels like for every one person ready to make an effort, there's like 10 people online ready to critique that one person. The fact is, the Oma isn't short of ideas. Seriously, we're not. We're short of people willing to put in that effort to make those ideas work. Can you say that one more time, please? Yeah, sure. We are short of people willing to put in that effort to make those ideas work. Now, will every idea you try work? No. And are you going to make mistakes? Most probably, yeah. And for the people who see those mistakes and give you constructive criticism, that's okay. But if that same person is willing to put in the effort with that constructive criticism, which means he's going to help you, that will be excellent. Unfortunately, that's not really the reality. Yes, there are some few that do it, but the majority of people, they don't. They just complain. It makes you wonder, maybe some people love to complain because they just love to complain. But seriously, don't let them discourage you. Coming up with an idea is the easy part. But to make that idea into a reality, it will require more than just talking about it. Do you know what I'm saying? Have you ever been in one of those masjid meetings where it's really loud because everyone's talking about their great idea for the masjid? But when the question comes up of who's going to implement these ideas, suddenly there's a silence. I'm not just talking about a silence, I'm talking about a dead silence. Idea, but unfortunately they don't share the same passion when it comes to implementing that idea. If you don't know what I'm saying, I'll give you a taste. Okay, next person in line, please. Assalamu alaikum, brother. The paint on the machine walls, brother, it's getting old, brother. It is getting old. You know how some people are old at the masjid, brother? It is older than them, brother. Jazakallah khair, bro. Actually, we do have um, paint in the back, but we don't really have anyone to paint it. I mean, I'm willing to come down um, whenever you have free time. No, 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 no. I have no free time, brother. I have no free time. But you had free time for an hour today when you stood in line to tell us about your complaint. What? You had free time? What? Suddenly he can't hear me? No, brother, I can do that. No, I have no free time. I have to get going before I get old, like the paint of the masjid has become old, brother. Somebody must do it, brother, but not me. Somebody that wants to do it, brother. Okay, can you send the next person in line, please? Brother, brother, brother. Oh, let me sit down. Let me tell you something, brother. I'm sure you remember me. The kids in the masjid, the ones in the Quran class, brother, the tajweed is not proper, brother. It is no good. Um, do you know proper tajweed? Of course! So can you help us teach the kids on your free time? What? I said, can you help us teach the kids on your free time? What? Now, I'm speaking to myself before I speak to anyone else. Because I used to complain a lot. A lot. 
And after a while, I realized complaining doesn't change anything. So I decided to start putting an effort in to make a change. So yeah, I need these reminders just like everyone else. You look around and you see so many problems. You can either talk about how everything sucks, or you can put an effort in to make a difference. I chose to put the effort in to make a difference. And if we all put a small contribution in to try and make a difference in this world, instead of just talking about it, maybe we can make a difference together so we have a better world to live in. This is Hallie, and that's my advice. If you want advice from a friendly, funny guy, ask Baba Ali.